Welcome Z Warriors, so we're going to discuss Kakarot's DLC, where the heck is it and what is going on, so do like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, follow me on TikTok as well people. So with Dragon Ball Kakarot, it's a beautiful game, amazing game, I don't think I've ever been to a point where I've been bored or even tired of playing the game after I've completed it so many times, you're probably the same. And we've got our DLCs, we had the first packs of DLCs which were great, then we've moved on to the newest pack of DLC which is obviously Bardock, a gameplay DLC we did didn't think we were gonna get ever but we did actually get it and it was great but obviously we've moved past the point of this Saiyans race and everything that's going on with them and Frieza and obviously gone to more of the past more of Goku which is the Tenkai Chibudakai tournament now the thing is we finally have a big trailer about it shows a lot what's going on what we can expect what we can see that we will be playing as other characters like Tien it's really interesting that we will have move lists for them so does this mean that we will have a tournament mode in this game as well where we will be able to play online or even versus a friend and fight against them because it would make a lot of sense and it would be really fun to do that now that they're giving us access to other characters but when it comes to that we don't have any actual DLC release date I am thinking that it will be coming in September that is when I do feel we will get this it would fit more likely to come then because I think they're probably still sorting out a whole load of other stuff with this because I mean the, the stage as you're looking right now is 10 times bigger than when you're flying around and then you see the stage I know you could probably say that over time they reduce the size of the stage but I don't think so I genuinely do think that this is just uh, the stage is a lot more bigger they've updated it because it's going to be a lot more stuff for you to do and I do believe that I do believe that we're going to be able to do a lot more stuff in this which is why it's taking so long but how come we haven't had anything else we haven't had a release date or anything I mean at least give us something to get hyped about with the release of it and then if you want to change it release another trailer at some point and then say yeah it's now moved to this day or just release a statement but the fact that we're not hearing anything again it's really mad this is the only Dragon Ball game where we want so much from it and it's releasing content so small and less and we're like why why is it taking so long for this to actually start we want to play all these things that Kakarot's and um, Tenkaichi DLC is showing and I can't wait for it as a lot of you guys can't either the game was fantastic it was brilliantly done and I can't wait to see where they're going I hope they do go to Super but then I also hope that they also do more Dragon Ball Z movies like Cooler and stuff like that Super 13 I would love them Bojack definite but obviously let me know people what do you think is going on do you think it's because of so much more they're adding into the game or making sure things are tested out right for online or even for versus modes and stuff like that now with the tournament and other characters being playable are they utilizing other fighters and characters from dragon ball z kakara like even people like margin blue and cell or do you think they're just taking their time but do like subscribe this is your boy future boy as always stay frosty peeps peace